Hello and welcome to Ergonomics in the Workplace. Common causes of injury. Poor posture while sitting. Poor body mechanics while lifting. Lifting too heavy of a load. And sustained postures either with sitting or standing. What you can do. Be mindful of your posture when sitting or standing. Use ancillary products to assist in achieving proper posture. Use ancillary products to aid in achieving better ergonomics. Be mindful of your body mechanics while lifting. Ask for help. Break up your tasks so you are not sitting or standing too long. Let us now look at your posture. Proper posture is pictured on the left. Our spine is a series of alternating C curves. The neck and the low back are a concavity, while the upper mid back is a convexity. Maintaining these curves in normal alignment is healthy. The image on the right demonstrates poor posture. When you sit at your work desk with your head forward and shoulders slouched, this results in a loss in the forward curve of the neck, increases the backward curve of the mid-back, and reduces the curvature of the low back. Sustaining these altered postures for prolonged periods of time results in pain and injury. Let us now look at ideal ergonomic sitting posture for work. As you can see in this image, your sitting posture begins with the correct height and adjustment of your chair. Adjust the height of your chair so that your eyes are in line with the top of your computer screen. Pick a chair that fully supports the curvature of your mid-back and your low back. Your arms should be almost vertical and your forearms horizontal or parallel to the floor, well supported by the armrests and the table. Your knee should be ever so slightly below your hip and your feet flat on the floor. Proper lifting techniques. When lifting, keep your back straight. Lift with your legs. Keep the item you are lifting close to your body. Don't lift anything you are not comfortable lifting. Ask for help. Here are some products that may help with your posture. Stand up desks that are collapsible and that can go on top of your work desk are easy to use in both the sitting and standing position. A lumbar roll or a mesh support that goes onto the back of your chair can be useful in supporting the curvatures of your spine. A footrest or raised chair cushion are both useful for people with either a shorter torso or short legs that do not reach the floor. Ergonomic keyboards mouse and mouse pads help maintain good positioning of the wrist and forearms. Here are some stretches that may help. Please pause to go over them as you feel is needed. Here are some stretches for the neck, stretches for the shoulder and upper back, and also stretches for the low back or trunk and legs. What you can do outside of work. It is a medical fact that improving core strength and flexibility will prevent injury. Think about joining a gym, go for walks, try yoga or Tai Chi, staying active and staying mobile helps prevent injury.